Hey everybody, it has been quite a long time since I have filmed. I haven't filmed since like the end of April and it's now July. I literally, the video that just went up on like today, which is like, I think July 6th, uh, that's been stuck on my cam, like it's been stuck on my iPad since May, like early May. And I just have not been able to get it uploaded. And I think I finally got it uploaded today. Let me messing up my lights. But yeah, life has just kind of been very stressful for me recently. I've just been having like car issues and just like some other stuff that's been happening in my personal life. I haven't put away any photo cards because I've been waiting to do it when I film. I did do some organization that I didn't film that I just did because one night I just wanted something to do and not think about, which was nice. But yeah, um, I have like over a hundred photo cards to put away. I have like this stack. Uh, this is all ATs. This is kind of insane how much I have to put away. And then I have this entire container. So this video is probably gonna be quite long, but I'm super excited. I miss filming. I know I've commented recently, not recently. You guys haven't seen me on here recently, but I've been saying in like videos that have been coming, I've been posting, like I've just been, this year has just not been the easiest for me. And so I would like to get back into filming more because I actually really love this channel and I love like sharing my collection so that is like a goal, but I would really like to start posting again more. I'm hoping to replace my phone soon. And once I replace my phone, hopefully that makes things easier. I might not be super active on here, but I am like often posting on TikTok and stuff. A mixture of like my photo cards and like little mini vlogs and video diaries. And sometimes I like film when I'm like messing with photo cards and stuff on there. And I've done unboxings on there for Stray Kids before, and I might do little short ones for the next comeback coming up. We'll have to see. But yeah, if you guys want to follow me there, I think it's the same as my Instagram. I think it's Barry Moonlight. I think <laughs> I'll put it in the, the little description box below. But yeah, let's get started with my AT's binder. I love this binder, even though it is definitely getting a little too full okay i <laughs> when i was out in vegas i found also i went to vegas for my birthday that's i bought an album there and then i bought this photo card it's a zero zero fever part one i realized i didn't collect son for fever part one i literally don't remember what photo cards i have for fever part one because I bought the album, but I literally can't remember who I pulled. I feel like I pulled Yo Sang, but um, I don't know a page. I need to go back and collect for Fever Part One, clearly. So we're just gonna put him here for now with Young, just until I can figure out that. I just couldn't pass up when I found that card. All right, I do really love how I collect ATs now. I don't really have to like stress about it and it's kind of just whatever I feel like doing. I do need two more song cards for Fever Part 3 though. I'm gonna look for those today. But I like that I don't have to necessarily organize like album versions with versions. I can kind of just do, what's the vibe? I did finally get my last card for Witness. People are curious why I really didn't collect Witness. It just happened when I was in a really not the best headspace and just a lot was going on personally and it was just one of the comebacks because it happened during the holiday. I just didn't really get to collect it. All right, I do. I was looking at this section. I want to get another one of this outfit and possibly another one of this. We'll see. 
I am seeing ATs this month, which I am very, very excited for. I don't, I realize I'm probably not gonna post like concert vlogs on here anymore. I'll just make TikToks of them. But I have a whole page of them in this outfit, which I really, really, really love. The birds are so loud outside. Hmm. I'm so sorry, son. You just have to go here for now. The little cutout card. My little four pocket of you know that I try to do every time. Okay, now we are on to the newest comeback. Binder is not gonna work too long. We'll have to see. How about looking to Meow Cafe binders? I hear a lot of really good things about their stuff. So we're gonna check out Meow Cafe. Okay. I think I had a game plan here, but I have like cards coming. I really, really lucked out with the Target version exclusives. I went album hunting and like the morning it came out with Leanne and I lucked out and both of my Target exclusives, because I got two Gigi packs, were double sawn and Leanne pulled Uno you know, and she clicks on two. So like we switched, it was perfect. The mukbang cards were the ones I struggled with. I had to trade away Uno to get Son because I wanted to make sure I got Son no matter what. But luckily, I got Uno back. I do have an extra Jungho mukbang card that I'm looking to either get Wuyong's version or another Son exclusive that I don't have. But I think my goal here is I'm going to put like these outfits match. So my goal, my original goal was I was only going to collect four cards from this comeback. I had other plans. I do have like a few more coming. So it's probably going to end up being way more. How much I love this binder. Realistically, I think they might have to end up in it re-ring again unless i can find a good meow cafe binder i like or if anybody has suggestions on something that's bigger that can hold my at's collection feel free to comment and let me know hmm Hmm. My random sangwa. Hmm. Put my hug here. And then we're gonna put these Wu Youngs here. Cause you know what? I would really like to collect. Maybe I'll do a little four pocket of Wu Young. Not counting this card. Maybe counting this card. All right, and then Super random merch for ATs. I went to the ATs like Coachella pop up. They did a Hello 82. I traded for them. I don't know how I ended up with them. The struggle was very real at points in time. Okay. Let's put you guys. You joined the ATs membership though, which not mad about. I didn't, I also got Sakura from La Seraphim's card from that event, which I was very happy with. I don't remember who I pulled, but I traded. And then I should get one more trading card of Son and then call it a day. But that is it for my little ATs binder. It feels like it's about to explode. I just really like how I decorated it and everything. I've 
changed my collection around so much for like so many different groups but i guess like that's the fun thing about having a collection you can kind of just change it however you want all right my chankyun binder this boy needs a second binder i might make a binder just for his solo stuff i'm also seeing him in august which i'm so excited about okay The first time I saw him, my friends were like shocked because I was like taken aback by his existence. Um, that is the only way I can put it. <laughs> like, I looked like I was about to cry because seeing him just felt unreal to me. Okay, I have a mix. I'm definitely, I'm gonna end up getting another binder for him. I feel like I have another binder somewhere. I still need two reason templates. I didn't put my phone in do not disturb mode and it keeps making noises for notifications and it's startling me that I'm running out of space. I feel like I put a heart for the cards I had coming. I really hope that I was that smart. Also, I don't know if I keep seeing these since I filmed. But I uh, got a template or I bought on Etsy, somebody made these and I now just use transparent sticky notes, which is very great. I want to finish him so badly, but I have cards coming on Paca and Paca Mart. There's like a random dot on that and I don't know where it came from. I'm really hoping I was smart and I did those hearts to let me know where to put cards. We'll find out. I think I did. I think I thought this through. These leaves can't find any little marks on them. I don't know from what. Okay. I need to go through my little template and see. Did I? <laughs> what did I do here? Mmm. Y'all are pocket versions. I think I have you coming. Okay. That like genuinely hurt my brain for a second. I was like, I don't understand what happened. Okay. 
Okay, I see. I see. This all now makes way more sense. Okay. Okay. I see what I did. Okay. The pocket section. I was like, I don't understand how I skipped the entirety of like an album. <laughs> Like an album version. Okay. Now we are on to... I think I got the off version. Maybe I didn't. You actually might be the Nemo version. This is the Nemo version. Okay. One sec. Oh. I got stuck. Turns out you can be going for like multiple months and still be a mess when filming. I don't know if I had a game plan here, but I'm just going to do this for now. And then we will like cross more bridges when we get there for organizing these. So I feel like I'm going to have to double side him at some point in time. Now we go into like the merchy section. I'm just gonna put these here for now. I'm just gonna put these here for now. Um, his cute little doll. than expected definitely need to figure out his binder situation but i feel like i need to figure out multiple people's binder situations right now i don't think you guys have seen this binder i originally filmed a video of me setting up this binder and i could never get those clips off my phone so that is a video that never happened <laughs> also this is a little too small but that's okay um i'm now collecting semen from psychers It just kind of happened. I don't, I don't know what happened or how we got here, but we got here. I feel like I need to get cyber. Cyber Jumin. Oh yeah, this is my uh my cute little Cypress collection. Small but mighty. Yeah, um decided I want to collect him. I think he's adorable. Alright, my Mark Lee collection. I'm <laughs> also fun fact. Seeing NCT Dream in September? Yes, September. All right. I need to, okay. I need to buy a faster version. I might get the Target version though. I might do the Target version. I 
kind of like, I was like, I need one more POB for two baddies as well. Okay, Ao. The way I literally went to Twitter to get a template, because in my head, I'm like, I literally don't know. I could not remember which version was A and which version was B. I don't think I have. Version A, he's holding that teacup. I have to find version A. Okay. Did you pack this many? come back for them i need to set up for it i don't have a game plan yet <laughs> we'll cross that bridge later i also need to finish fact check i know we'll cross that bridge when we get there i do really like how i collected to be there for me though Oh, I still need one B there for me card. Huh. All right, that is it for Mark Lee. All right, let's um, pull away some from my Japanese binder right now. I never really collected circus. I don't know why. <laughs> also, I think missing one or two cards from this. My favorite things about the Japanese comebacks though are these units. these here for now because I don't know what to do with these cards from Toy World at the moment. But yeah, that was it for this binder. My Rockstar binder. I'm going out of order from what I have in this little pile, but it's honestly what binder I can grab first. to go through and like fully organize these okay that's it for this binder oh wait this binder was missing for a good 10 minutes and i couldn't figure out where it was it turns out it was with my nct little binders One more of these. Okay. I haven't opened this binder in a minute. I really wish I would have known that I was missing. I didn't have any Lino in these because I could have got them in Vegas.
this is the year that I kind of pulled back quite a bit on what I was collecting for Stray Kids. I'm just gonna put this here for now. Um, yeah, I'm kind of pulled back. Like, I don't need everything. This comeback, I'm not gonna be collecting every POB because it's so excessive now. I just financially can't keep up. But I did collect Stay Zone for three of the four days. I wasn't the hugest fan personally of Argus two of the three days. I wasn't a fan of the one where they were holding like the stuffed animals, but I did collect I did collect a bunch of the POBs. I have some more coming. Yeah, I have some more coming. I do have some more of the merch coming. And then I guess I uh, forgot <laughs> to put those away. But I feel like I grabbed that binder earlier. All right, it goes in this binder. I didn't miss this binder. I was like, did I ever get this? I need to get Changbin's Cleo card. This is all of my non JYP merch. I don't know where Chan is. <laughs> I bought him. I don't know where he is or he was in a go. I'll look for him later. I feel like I just recently got him too. Do have more of these like milk cards coming. I did round two as well. Oh my gosh, where is that card? I'll have to find them later. <laughs> okay, on to another binder that you guys have not seen. This was in that setting up video that I really wish I could explain why I couldn't get off my bike, my phone, but I just couldn't. I think that's as good as it's gonna get. My ring light. But uh, ZB1 needed its own like full blind binder. They were getting way too full for a smaller binder. Supposedly they're having another comeback in August. know if I set up for these cards. Also, I'm collecting hand bid for regular cards and just some random pubes. I don't feel like I uh, mentioned that. Oh, I did have so okay, solar. I thought these were the I wish Ricky would have had red hair in every photo card. It would have made everything a little more easy. I'm sorry, Ricky. There's just going to be a glare on you for now. Yes. I 
think I'm gonna end up having office for hand bin too, so we will figure that out. He'll just end up in the middle. Look how stinking cute these cards are. I'm like obsessed. Some of their little Zeronis. Okay, please tell me I kind of sort of thought this through a little bit. With Mew head tap. See about ice cream. How did some of these just not make the cut? Oh, I think I got overwhelmed with the amount and trying to like navigate it when I was setting this up. That's why. Okay, so we're just gonna put these all together except for these because Fuji Media goes here. Ice cream boy. We're just gonna put these here for now. And then I will sort more once I have more. No way there's not a million empty pages. No ice cream goes there. All right. All right. And then I just have some random. I have Medi Hill. I'm not going to put these in here yet because I'm not sure where I'm going to put them, but I have their Medi Hill cards. It's very cute. Yeah. The way I dropped the entirety of my NCT Dream photo cards that were supposed to be put away to the point I almost went to cry because I thought I lost a Geno. All right. <laughs> I need to like go through and like really try to like complete everything. I don't know why Hello Future is such a struggle for me. I was like, I feel like I have some of these cards coming. Okay. My um, dream pile is very large. But then again, I haven't put away, I can't feel anything, uh, not, I haven't put away Dreamscape in a while. I'll try to change these to clear sleeves soon. 
because I ended up collecting like Dreamscape way more thoroughly than I thought I was gonna do. Like I collected the Japanese versions for both Mark and Jeno and like the Amazon version. But I lucked out, like the Amazon version, me and Leanne got really lucky. I pulled Jeno and Renjin and she pulled Mark. So we just traded. Okay, that unit's there. I was like, what's in the middle of this page? Then I ended up collecting more QBs than expected. We pulled when we bought the keychains, like their new little character keychains. When we bought these guys, we didn't realize there was POBs and we pulled Jeno. So I ended up with Jeno. So he's just gonna be the centerpiece of this because I don't know if I wanna spend the money to buy Mark. Maybe I will. Honestly, it's so hard to match these outfits. Honestly, this is one of my favorite photo cards of him. I think it's so funny, but I love it so much. He looks so cute. And then I ended up collecting the Mumo units. And if I end up getting more POBs, these won't be in the middle. But for right now, they're just like the middle of this page. Jeez, I'm gonna, Chen La are gonna make an appearance now. I actually really love this page. This page is probably gonna be the cover of this video. I think what I, what drives me kind of insane about their like POBs is that like for some of the concepts, like I wish they were at least in the same outfits from the same concept. Some of them are super random. Like Jenna's in a tank top here and Mark is in his I can't feel anything outfit. I'm counting these as POBs. I know they're technically merged from this. I'm making up the rules now, okay? But like, at least with these two, they're both in there, I can't feel anything. But like, this is a completely different outfit from this one. But see, it like throws me off so much. All right, and then on to the trading cards from this. I'm gonna put the selfies on a page together and then I'll put all the concepts on a page together. Because they kind of threw me off with the I can't feel anything version. It made it a little more difficult than planned.
Okay, so you guys are gonna notice the lighting is different. My nails are now different. It is literally a couple weeks later. I had this video fully edited and getting ready to um, upload it when for some reason the final clip of this was, was me putting away my EXO stuff just disappeared. I don't know what happened to that clip and it's just gone. It wasn't on my phone like because I took everything off my phone once I went on my iPad and that clip was just gone. So um, I'm going to refilm it putting away Suho's um, solo. But yeah, I don't know what happened to it. I also lost a Stray Kids clip, but I literally only put away a single photo card. So I'm just going to put that away when I film next. Yeah, I don't know what happened exactly to be really honest because I had that uploaded I had that not uploaded I had that like fully edited very quickly and then just life was crazy this last week this last two weeks so I haven't been able to like upload it to my computer and it was gone and so we're just gonna re-put this away and I'll talk about how I'm collecting it because I was only gonna put away the cards I had but I wanted a very loud car just drove by I wanted to talk about like how I'm collecting this. I really, really love this comeback. And I'm so glad I get to collect stuff for him again. This is gonna be, on this page, it's gonna be both the photo books and the Schmini version will be on this page. I have two of the question mark albums literally on their way from a group order i ordered from a group order and got k-town for you pobs and then i bought this version in vegas and i pulled this card oh yeah i realized uh since the last video was updated i don't i guess i mentioned it probably in this video that i went to vegas for my birthday and i'll put the schmini at the bottom i actually have these pcs I got them off of Macari Japan. And then I will put the two tape PCs. And then the rest of this page is gonna be POVs. I bought Mimo. K10 for you is on its way. They're not gonna be necessarily next to like the store per se. It's whatever flows together. I did low-key just want to get all of him as a bunny, but I haven't. But yeah, it's K-Town for you. This is Dear My Muse. I only bought one of them. I found this set in LA, but this one was my favorite. And if I bought another one, it was going to make everything very complicated. And that's why I haven't got the Soundwave card that I'm contemplating getting that he's sticking his tongue out in. And so I have Mumo coming, K-Town for you, A Dear My Muse, and then I did Everline round two for Lucky Draws. And then I just have one more Chanyeol card to put away. I did get two more of these to finish this page, but I literally don't remember which two it was. So this is the entire page now. I have... The top row is cream soda, and then these are the exist ones. I think for this, it's going to be, Chanyeol's going to be down here until they do Pink Christmas again, and then Suho will take up this page, but until then, that's how this looks. And I think I have one more POB coming from this. I feel like I do. It's random merch. Is Universe sing for you? Oh, it's Universe. Okay. There we go. I need to get hit. I want to work more on him this year. I would like to collect more EXO this year. I still have still have like five months I could still do good more there we go I still would like to 
know what happened to that clip. It got rid of my outro and everything. And then I put away a single Stray Kids photo card. And then I was talking about how I was collecting the Stray Kids comeback. But I'll talk about that when I set up for it in the next video. All right. Um, I hope everybody is doing really well. I'm trying to be more active on here. I'm just having editing issues. I'm hoping when I get a new phone, that's going to fix the issues for me. But we'll have to see. Um, how is everyone's collecting going? I hope it's going well. I hope everyone's getting the cards that they really want. I think that's going to be it for this video. Goodbye, everyone. Okay.